What's up guys, Christian Fryland here at Legends Golf Center. If you've got a junior golfer or a young child learning to play golf for the first time, there is a lot of information out there or you may have heard a lot of things that will help them learn to play good golf. And that's good. There's, it's good that there's a lot of information out there, but the issue is what actually works. What's going to help them get the ball in the air, hit it relatively straight, be able to go on the golf course and have fun, all right? So we've got to boil it down to what actually helps them do that. And really, I think it's two things, okay? The first is consistent low point or where their club is bottoming out. And the second is controlling their club face coming into the golf ball, okay? Or kind of a, a blend of centerness of contact and club face angle, all right? So I've got two drills that will really help your junior golfer do that well. The first one is a low point drill. So I've got a piece of paper here on the ground. We're outside, uh, what I normally use is a quarter uh, or a nickel. And the goal is to actually hit that quarter or nickel up in the air. The paper won't move as much, but you can still see. Okay, so I really hit that paper and it moved all the way off the mat. If it was a quarter or a nickel, it'd go flying down range, okay? So they learn to strike the ground. So then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a golf ball and you're gonna put it on top of that quarter or nickel or piece of paper that we're using here. And you're gonna have them, again, not worry so much about hitting the golf ball, but worry about striking the uh, quarter or nickel or piece of paper under the golf ball. Okay, so again, you see the paper move off the mat, struck the ball, I got it airborne. Once they can do that consistently, so here's the interesting thing. All this stuff about where their arms should be, where their head should be, where their wrists, where their hands, all that will fall into place as they perform this function, especially for younger kids, okay? So all the talk out there about they have to have the right grip, um, they have to have their arms in certain positions, that doesn't really matter because once they learn to strike the mat and get the ball in the air, the club face is going to start taking care of itself and their form is actually going to start taking care of itself. The second drill that you can do with them is take two golf balls and you're going to set them about an inch or so on each side of the club head and you're going to ask them to swing right through this gate and hit the mat. And then take a golf ball, go right in the middle. Again, and swing right through that gate, hit the mat underneath the golf ball. All right. Again, now they're starting to hit the sweet spot. They're starting to control the club face and they're getting the ball in the air and they can go have fun and play golf. So all the information out there, you can kind of throw it out the window and do these things as they perform this function, their form will fall into place um, and they'll learn how to play golf and they'll have fun. So give it a try.